Hi there everyone, here is Florian from Equipment Studios and today I want to show you two things about Adobe PDFs. Um, first of all, I want to show you how you can create a text area in a PDF form which is justified. That's nothing uh, Acrobat uh, Pro or Adobe Reader can uh, can do f uh, from them uh, themselves. Um, they need some help and I want to show you how you give them this little piece of help. So I just created a PDF form. Um, nothing special here, only uh, five text areas and then a picture uh, or object area. Um, how to create this uh, I'll show you in the next video I think. Um, so we have our text areas. Now we go to uh, edit, um, edit PDF form. Uh, I got it here in my upper bar. Uh, you can find it under tools, um, forms and edit. So well if we are in this menu to create, add and uh, edit uh, our existing fields. Um, this one I create. Uh, this one I created with uh, InDesign, so they are already there, but not uh, specified. Um, so we right-click on our text area, choose Properties, and um, if this window pops up, uh, we can check up for options, and under Options, we have the normal alignment. So we can send it, left it or right it, but there is no justification. So there's a uh, yeah, not so nice, but uh, yeah, existing trick. Um, that's this um, allow rich text formatting option. If we turn this option on, and of course, uh, do what you want in these properties, but if this is uh, checked and we close the format, uh, form editing we can click in our text area press command E on a Mac or control E on a Windows PC and we got this form field text properties and now we can format this text area in rich text format um, so we can choose the uh, font the font color whether it should be bold, italic, underlined, stroke, uh, superscript or um, subscript, everything else. And now here is the option for justification, just here on the left, uh, left quarter, together with the line left, center and right, but the justification is only, uh, only to find in this properties pop up and now if we take some text I think some Lauren uh, Lorem Ipsum text will get it um, Lorem Ipsum so the generator takes something like that so copy that stuff and now we paste it so we see it's normally formatted by the generator and we uh, mark it and set on justification and voila the text is justified till I found that many hours were gone away uh, and so I hope you enjoy this function and will now be able to justify your PDF forms especially for other users and of course you can uh, use this option in uh, Adobe Reader, Adobe Reader. So uh, if you create the form in Acrobat Pro, just save as other Reader Extended PDF and enable more tools. Um, if we click on that, we got this error message or this alert message um, that uh, another yeah, editing of this PDF will not be able any longer. If we save it as Reader. Uh, enabled so check up that everything works quite well as you like it and then save it as a reader PDF so just on the desktop use and reader 
save it. Now it's automatically opened, you see up here in the top bar, and we check it with the reader, of course. Everything else doesn't make any sense, so here's the PDF. Open with check for Adobe Reader 11. Maximize it, job, and now we can group. We can delete this text stuff, press Command or Control E, and there are our properties. If we insert any text, we can align it centered, left sided, right sided, and of course, again, justified. Everything else in Adobe Reader 2. That's fine. That's good for our uh, for our clients and everyone who wants to work with forms you make. And so just have fun with this function and check up Equipment Studios for later videos. I now create one for picture uh, placeholders in Adobe PDF forms. So check up if you like and see you soon.